Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's the morning of day four on my Darkness Falls for 7 Days to Die series, Alpha 20. Uh, we made a few things last night. I made a couple of sham soup. I bought some stuff out of the uh, vending machine. Let's go ahead and use one of those before we leave here this morning. I'll put one away. Got a couple things to sell the trader here, not much. Um, we're going to get out of here. We do have that quest to do, but we need to pick up stuff for food. Uh, That's the, one of the major things anymore. we need to do today. So, um, also, there was an issue. I spent 200 coin to get the scrap right, do the math. scrap tools recipe, and it didn't show up. We got the workbenches, but we didn't get the scrap tools for some reason. I'm not going to spend a point to get it again. There's no point. But, um, yeah, that's the thing that happened. All right, looks like it's starting to let up now. All right, let's see what we got out here. It was pretty quiet last night. Heard a couple people walking around, but not very many. See ya. Well, maybe not quite yet, but now we can see ya. All right, you two. Oh, uh, okay. Don't even know my own strength. Sorry about that, buddy. Don't even know my own... Oh, how'd you get in? You climbed over, probably. Now you're stuck inside. I can't have that, though. I gotta kill him. How are you doing? 66? Okay. Made a little bit better bone knife last night, too. Because I got a feeling we're going to be hacking up a lot of goop. It's all quiet over there. Oh, you're dead. All right, we got to get back in and kill this guy. Ooh, goop. Goop! Ah, uh, we got we to get in there and kill that guy. Because he might uh, decide to wreck a bunch of stuff. He could break the forge or whatever. You, you never know, right? I don't have the ability to make one. Oh, yeah, these are growing. Good. Good, good, good. Hey, Mo. Ooh, that's got to hurt, huh? I like I felt that. He's regenerating. So Even though he's bleeding, he's still regenerating enough to get enough health back. Yeah, we're still we're still ending up with the weird problems in here. I don't know why. It's just in the trader pretty much. And I got to deal with crappy textures, unfortunately. So yeah, that's a thing. All right, we need to pick up feathers today. Um, we need to get as many potatoes and carrots as I can find until we can get another farm plot going. And then we need to be back at a relatively good time because tonight is horde night. So we need to grab all of our stuff and get over to our, well, I don't want to call it a horde base, but get over to the rooftop. We'll hang out there tonight. So today will be a pretty easy day. I think we're just going to pull this one mission off. I might go hit up that Cracker Book too, depending on how well we do here. Because if we can get the, um, the mini bike book, we can work towards getting a mini bike because we have that workbench now. We can make our own too, which is nice. I also realized last night I shouldn't have put that, um, that, uh, there we go. The tailoring workstation down because I can't pick it up. It's stuck inside the trader now. I don't know if I can get a land claim block down on the outside that's going to encompass where it's located. So it's probably stuck in the trader for good, which is unfortunate, but, um, yeah, it is what it is. We needed the space, the backpack space. Did I just hear a dog? I'm hearing things. It's freaking me out because a dire... I mean, I'm not that worried. A dire wolf could kill us, but I don't think he's fast enough to catch us. We have that extra little bit of a bonus now on our run speed because of the jacket. So we're at 105. So as long as we don't have shit on us, should be able to outrun him. Okay, what's over here? Besides a bit of lag. Some plastic. 
seven coal. Might as well just grab it. Egg, one feather. Let's grab the plastic. Okay, this place has got a ammo crate and a uh, gun bag. So we're going to hop in there. So we're level six right now, which isn't too bad. We've got to get to level 10 to be able to make a double barrel shotgun. And we also have to have our gun crafting up at level two. So I'm going to save up my next four points. I spent two points last night. I put one into Blade Guy so we have better stamina when fighting zombies. And I put the second one into Science Crafting because I wanted to make a mod. I want to make a uh, um, extended magazine mod for the uh, pistol, but I can't do that just yet. I need steel, which means now that we've got a wrench, we can wrench some steel today. I need five steel for that. It's the only thing we're missing. Which we should be able to pick up no problem out while we're out and about today. Somebody's in here. Hey, Miss, Monsieur Le Biker. Come on, get up. We ain't done yet. We ain't done. You are, but I ain't. All right, let's take this. Three feathers, huh? Sure. Okay, now I know there's a ammo crate up here, which we might as well just get into first. And then uh, we'll wrench it apart. Looks like we're almost up a level here. So by the time we get to level 10, we'll have four skill points. We'll put one into weapon crafting, one into tool crafting, one into gun crafting, and then one into shotguns, I think. That's lousy. Let's break this apart. Did we get only forged iron out of that? We did. Normally you get steel out of that. All right, you're taking your time. I like to blame it on your number of hit points, but that's not the case. Okay, you're done. You're done. Now, how many lockpicks do we have? Let's go ahead and scrap you. We've got nine. I'm willing to use about four on this one, so let's see if we can get it. Nah, I'm not gonna bother wasting the rest of them on that thing. Not at this level, anyway. If we got a, if we got lucky, great, but I'm not going to be spending all my time trying to figure that out. Okay, coffee. Coffee. Nothing in the cooler. And what do we got here? Holy stink. No shotgun parts, though. Piss we can make a pistol, though. I think we got enough gear for that now. Take all of that. See what's in the kitchen here. Another cooking grill. Ooh, potato. Another cooking grill. Okay, some stuff to sell. Some water. Alright, not bad. Let's scrap those cooking grills. Scrap this chair. Actually, let's just... Yeah, that's worth 40. We don't have any money. Let's just keep it. Alright, we're already overloaded. Let's get to where we need to go. Well, hello there. Hello there. So the offline playthrough that I did, I used that building there as my horde night for the first, I don't know, seven or eight. Well, no, it was about four hordes, I think, I used this place as. And I just kept repairing the, um, I kept repairing the, the walls and stuff underneath, just upgrading them to cobblestone. And um, I used this as like a walkway up to me. I broke half of that out, put some bars up. And they didn't really jump up, they just were down below trying to bang on shit the whole time. So, um, I'm going to grab a bit of stone here and then we're going to do this. I can come back and grab the rest of the resources another time. Nothing there. Bit of iron. Bit of iron. Alright, where are we going here? They're slowly starting to come. Okay, um... I know there's a bird up here. 
Let's smoke him. It's down below, pretty much in the middle, I think. There's a level. Excellent. Uh, check this. Well, we needed uh, feathers, so we got them now. I can lay off hitting up these bird nests for the next little while. Let's just drop that. Uh, we might as well... Let's just use a couple of these. Keep our water up. Okay, not much there. That's locked. What are the other doors locked to? Three, four. You are. Might as well get it all in one shot here. And we'll loot this room in a second. I think there's somebody behind here. There is, and you're a silent sleeper, and I love that. Yeah, day four horde. So, why did that show up in the morning? I thought I had that set to evening. Oh, you know what it is? I think it just shows up at that point in time because it's the last day it could possibly be the horde, so it probably just shows up in the morning just to remind you. Although, maybe it's not. Maybe I... Ooh, that's really nice. Maybe I said it wrong. I'm sure I said it for... for um, to let me know in the evenings. Okay, scrap that. We'll take that. I'm actually going to take this die out now. Modify, drop you out. We're competing outfit now. I'm trying to figure out if we're going to get more orange or more black. So now we got three orange and two black. Okay, what do we got? Ooh, a beaker. Definitely take that. Hood that we can add to our current one. We've got at least two zombies outside. Okay, our treasure is in the kitchen. Gotta be somebody in there. Yeah. Just want to make sure it's the uh, guys outside. I'm hearing and nobody in here. Okay, nobody there. What do we got here? Loot, 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 loot. Oh, you're coming in here? Oh, you are. It's unlocked, though. Could have just knocked, buddy. Could have just knocked. Bit obnoxious of him. Uh, scrap that. Hopefully we can find some canned food here. Ah, uh, water. Some lead. There's our bag. Job well done. Okay, let's see what else we got here before we leave. Well, we need the main loot. So main loot's in the attic, so we're going to grab that before we go, too. So, um, go ahead and scrap you. Zombies are taking their sweet ass time getting in, which is good. Grab that. Uh, grab that. Scrap you. And we'll scrap these guys. Locked. That's the way up. Ooh, come on, get up. There you go. There you go. Use some more brass. AK schematic. Let's just use that. We've already got that, so we can just go ahead and scrap it. Um, anything else in here we want? Not really. Let's break our way into the bathroom. Just in case we can get a toilet pistol or something. All quiet. Beautiful. Nitrate powder, which we need. Alright, we might want to pop that uh, thing before we go home. Yeah, I think we're done down there. Okay, this is all nothing. Now, right, here we go. See how many of them make them make it to me. Ooh. Zero. Zero. Man. Wish I could pick those up. Wish I could pick them up. But whatever. 
At least it's a good way to watch my back while I'm in here. I know there's another safe here. I'm not going to bother trying to pick it. Grab that. <sighs> Scrap you. Anything good in here? We've been getting really lousy loot, but that's all right. Okay, we can repair you because it'll be worth more. We'll take that stuff. At least we got lots of first aid, which I haven't actually needed to use yet, which is nice. At some point we'll get to use it, but just not today. That's really good. We're going to need all that stuff. Take all that. And nothing there. All right, so let's get the hell out of here. Uh, is that garbage? That's a backpack. Another water. Stay away from the landmines. They are not your friends. Let's just get out of here. I think we can just pop out of the bathroom. Did I pick this already? I did not. Empty jar. Plastic. What do we get from the cart? Anything? A little bit of iron. A little bit of iron. Never hurt anybody. Hey, you're making your way in finally, eh? Did I already get that? I did. Well, hurry up, buddy. I ain't hanging around. Uh, now I gotta get steel. Um, so we're heading back that way. So let's go out of town this way. And I'm gonna make my way back. I don't like this, but we're gonna do it. Make my way back along on the outside of town looking for carrots and potatoes. Yeah, early game Darkness Falls is always like hard on food, but once we get things rolling, it'll be a lot easier. Okay, so I think we picked up enough for two. We got three carrots. I know I've got two carrots at home. And we've got five potatoes now, so five of each. Be nice if we can find two more, but we got enough for the next day's food, which is all right. And we can always buy stuff at the trader if we have to, the money that we're making. We're doing okay. I think, I think though, tomorrow... Actually, you know what? Let's grab our stuff for Horde. Which we're not going to need a lot. And then we're going to go downtown. I think we're going to go to that crack book today. I think I want to see what kind of schematics I can pick up in there. Because if we can find the pump shotgun schematic, then uh, after we finish level 10, uh, we definitely will not have to worry about um, um, what we're using as a weapon. Yeah, we really need to find a better place to live. Okay. Oh, I'll do business. Will you? Well, I guess you ain't so Shotgun, bad. duck bill, regular pistol. Trouble. Level twenty. I mean, we could combine the two pistols and make it twenty-one. I can hold two mods. Hmm. I don't want. The, I mean, I'd just be selling the duck bill anyway, and the mods aren't in this mo in this version aren't worth as much as they were in the past. Let's grab the. Let's grab that. Uh, can I see your inventory? You do have some stuff to sell here. Not a lot, though. I'm going to just straight up sell that. I'm going to sell that. That can go. I don't know if you're going to want that. Oh, you will. Okay, beautiful. Um, what else do we have here that we can sell? This guy can go. I'm going to use that to upgrade my current hood. Ooh, all this cash. 500 bucks right there. How much do we have now? Over 1,000? We do. So I could buy... I mean, we could go ahead and buy the, the 10 Molotovs. Because that'll guarantee us making a good chunk of uh, experience tonight on the Horde. Let's just hold off, though, for a second. Are Let's take this. Done? Yeah, yeah, I'm done. Leave me alone. Actually, you know what? Before we do anything else, there's a couple more things in here I want to buy. Uh, I think I want to buy all of you. Ooh, do we pick up chicken soup? We picked up one can item, white right? Chicken soup. Yeah, let's just buy these three. We'll cook those up. So we'll have enough extra for tomorrow. Somebody's banging on the walls again. Let's get those going. Um, take these out. Two of them. Great. Now let's put the stuff away. All right, we're slowly getting things done here. Let's just use this real quick. So we've got two more um, steak and eggs cooking, which I'll take with me tonight. I think I'm going to take half of you 
We'll get a stack of that going tonight as well. So it'll just be done tomorrow. 302. So that should be enough. We're going to upgrade our pistol. Let's take what we need for tonight. We're going to take the 12 Molotovs. I mean, that might be enough. We'll take the pipe bombs. We want to take our rifle. Uh, we definitely want to take the shotgun because I want to try and rank up my shotgun tonight. So we'll take those. Uh, we don't need that. Let's grab the cobble. Let's just grab a little bit of it. I think that's probably all we're going to need. I mean, we got food and everything on us. Uh, let's wait for those to finish. Let's go down now. Uh, let's modify you. Because I think when you merge stuff, um, you lose whatever's in it. So, for instance, if I had a pistol with, with ammunition in it, and I merge it with another pistol, um, the ammo that was in the original pistol is gone. I'm pretty sure that's how it works. So you got to make sure you always uh, unload everything before you merge stuff. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's how it works. All right. Level 21 pistol. Nice. Now our hood. Bring that down. That should be like 19 now. Maybe 20. 19. Okay, so modify you. Complete. And where are you? Bring you back down. We didn't get any steel to get a magazine extender on this guy, but that's fine. I think we have everything except for the steak and potatoes, which we'll grab real quick, then we'll go smoke this Texas guy out front here. Not right now. Um, 17 seconds. Uh, mm, tell you what. Yeah, let's just wait the 17 seconds. I was going to say let's just grab one of the other uh, chicken soup, but we'll be fine. Uh, now i got to decide if I'm going to buy those Molotovs. Tell you what, let's buy eight. We'll have a, we'll have a full stack. Close that up. All right. Uh, can I see your inventory? Secret stash. I mean, if we can avoid using them all, great. I feel pretty good about There's that. Now, else. um, you best be on your way. Fetch to the west. Fetch to the Two, south. Three, two. Good luck. Sure. Alright, we're gonna go downtown. Follow me. We're going downtown. Oh, uh, yeah. One thing I can't forget to take. Or do I need it? Now we're good. I was gonna say we should probably take repair kits, but I'm not gonna be doing that much damage. How did you... Sure, whatever. All right, let's go to the the uh, cracker book. It'll be nice if we can actually get the pump shotgun schematic. Horde base is right there, so we should be good. Actually, I'm gonna do this just so we know where we gotta go when we come out of here. If I'm panicking for the last last little bit of the uh, run, should be fine though. Should have a fair bit of time. Yeah, it's only noon. We got lots of time. Clear up this cracker book. I mean, we, I guess we could even go check that place out. This has got a weapons box in it. Oh, you know what we do need to do, though? I got to get some steel. Maybe we do that first. Like, we may have to go downtown and get the steel. I gotta climb those posts with the uh, transformers. So I might want to just do that near the cracker book if I can. Come on, buddy. Kind of embarrassing yourself right now. Let's go. Get nothing out of that guy. Got a couple more zombies here. Yeah, there's a transformer there we can grab. We gotta kill these zombies first, though. Have some steel. Okay, that's actually not bad. Give you some time to get out of there. Let's 
smoke you. And then let's get up here real quick. Hopefully nobody comes along. Are you serious? You had to wait for me to get up there, eh? Hold that. Okay, bleed. You should you should die. You got a bit extra. Still don't got the juice to take me on though. Come on, buddy. So I think what we do maybe by I don't know, like day seven or something, maybe after the second horde. We'll wait for the second horde to finish. Or uh, maybe I'll turn up the zombies day speed to jog. Just to give them a bit more of a fair fight during the day. Okay, there's one steel. Two. Three. Four. Except for that weapon box not having any, I'll tell you. Alright, now, uh, one more transformer. There's our cracker book. Should be a transformer downtown, though. What's up, buddy? Yeah, see, if these guys were on jog, they would definitely be a threat. Especially with the numbers that can that come around, you know? Took that one in the back of the head. Um, okay, there's the crack. I don't see any transformers. I know we can get stuff off the light poles, but I don't like wrecking the aesthetic of the city. Oh, there we go. Wrecking the aesthetic of the city. The transformers missing, you don't really notice them. Ooh, but if light poles are missing, or uh, the actual overhanging lights are missing, then it's like, I just kind of notice it. And it kind of bugs me. Come on. Steel. Steel. There we go. How long would it take to make a... Um, Magazine extender. Mod magazine extender. A minute and a bit. Alright, let's loot the crack book. Then. Yeah, we got lots of time. Ah, I'm so glad I made this spear early. Even on warrior difficulty, these guys are like paper now. The exception of the handful of tough ones. Right over your freaking shoulder. Alright, just fucking wake up. There you go. Let's get it done. I haven't decided what my second uh, skill class is going to be yet. I should probably do that. Scrap armor. AK and bow. Let's use this. Because that gives us our second level of bow crafting. Oh, hey, buddy. I'm going to fuck you up. Oh, I already did. Never mind. You just got fucked up. Scrap those two. That was me. That was me that did that. Okay, we'll grab a bunch of this and then we'll scrap a bunch in a row. Oh, that's nice to get. Register's open. Cha-ching. That's nice too. Let's get back out here. Oi! Okay, we can scrap these guys. Scrap. Use. Scrap and scrap. We still need to find the aloe cream recipe. But if we find aloe cream, then we can make first aid bandages. Though Not that we're actually using any of them, but it's nice to have that ability for later game. If we actually need them and we're out someplace, uh, we can actually make them if we have to. Oh, okay. Re reloading weekly, that can give us the ability to make 9 mil ammo. The next level gives us, I think, shotgun. Oh, there's the next level of workbenches. Yeah, see, it was totally worth coming here. Okay, that'll give us shotgun and... Oh, wait. 
Yeah, I think that gives us shotgun and 7.62. Still no... Still no... Uh, got that already. There's the mini bike book. So we've got... Now, nah, I mean, we can't use it yet because it's, it's level gated. Right? So we got to be player level 10. And then that'll pop up when we can actually make it. We've got a functioning workbench. This we need to have gun crafting three, so we can't make that yet. Uh, reloading weekly. We need gun crafting two to make 7.62 and magnum rounds. Wait. And shotgun slug. This makes regular shotgun shells. Okay. Workbench tools. So we should have the second level of workbenches, which I think opens up in tool crafting two, which we should get by level 10, I think. We'll go ahead and take that at level 10. And then we got both those. Make a better bow as soon as we get to level 10. And we get next level of weapon crafting. Oh, there's a turret schematic. Um, yeah, let's just use it now. Sure. I don't know when we're going to get a chance to make a turret, though that's the thing. We may actually have the... Uh, the actual class that allowed oh there's the last two books so that w means we have that done to level four excellent so early in the game too next level of forge next level of vehicle okay so we can scrap you scrap you scrap you we'll use you and we'll use you that gives us the ability to make motorcycles now because maybe we skip the mini bike altogether we got both those now. We can scrap that. Maybe we skip the mini bike altogether and go straight to the uh, motorcycle. P225 schematic. Put them back here. Okay, let's use you. We can scrap this. We need a specific receiver for the P225, so we can't just craft it out of regular pistol parts, unfortunately. Okay, more stuff that we can just get rid of. Keep working on it, guys. I'm not breaking in there to get you. Okay, we got the 44 schematic. Let's scrap this, because this is our farmer skills already. Ooh, we should probably have enough pages to make another book. Come on, hurry up. Ain't got all day. Still a lot of the same. Still a lot of the same. Oh, there you go. You finally got it. Only to come out and get yourself killed. Thank you for showing up. Alright. Gets the consolation prize of, an, of a spear to the face. Get all those scrapped. Yep, that, we're going to have enough to make a, uh, a class book. Grab you. So this was fruitful. We didn't get the shotgun schematic though. So let's go ahead and use you. Because I don't think we've got the pistol one yet. Might as well have the ability to make them because if we can make like high level pistols. There's the lever action rifle. Like if we had the ability to make like high level pistols, we can actually, when we find parts, we can actually just make them and sell them. Ah, uh, how did I miss you twice? Fuck off. I'm like killing everything in the kitchen except for these guys. Everything in the kitchen but the zombies. Alright, we're done with the books here, I think, so... We'll make our way back to the trader. And then we'll do go ahead and get... Um, there's the next level. That's two levels today. We'll go ahead and get the... Um, extended magazine mod crafted. I was really hoping we could find that shotgun schematic, but... No damn luck, unfortunately. I mean, I guess we could kind of go in the back, back room and try and find it, but... Not that interested at this point. Come on. Scrap you guys. Alright, let's GTFO. 
Uh, we've got enough steel. So we're good. Yeah, let's go. And murder mole in the way. Come on, buddy. Ooh, what do you give us? Oh, something to eat. Let's use that. And we might as well use one of these now, too. Actually, no. Let's use um, one of these guys. Give us some digestive efficiency. And I think I'm probably going to check out this. Yeah, we're going to need to get a work. A, um, level 33. Scrap one. Okay, I think we're going to need to get a uh, repair kit for the spear. I don't think we're going to be using the spear a lot tonight, but if we have to jump down for whatever reason and we're fighting on foot, I'm definitely going to want to rely on the spear to knock shit down. Because the pistol just doesn't have the stopping power to knock zombies over, whereas the spear does. Alright, before we go upstairs, let's just go over here. Because I want to go ahead and do this. And then modify you. Take this off. And I guess I could have done it when we came back down, but might as well do it while we're here. Where are you? Oh, right there. Derp. And then we might as well do this one as well. Get that maxed out. And we'll modify you. Excellent. Now, um, let's sell this guy the cash. Drop your weapons or drop your drawers. I want to sell you all of that, buddy. Thirteen hundred. Might as well sell you this over here. We take the purple die too for ten. Yeah, beautiful. Okay. Uh, what I want to do though is I want to go and buy those last two Molotovs. Make sure we buy all his Molotovs. Are we oh, done here? Uh, no, we don't have enough for the shotgun mod. Shotgun choke mod's not happening. Okay, now, um, drop what we can in here. We need the steel on us. Those guys can go in there. Extra Molotovs. Let's just hold on to those for tonight. We might need them. Okay, so, what were we doing? Oh, we want to get rid of the high-powered ammo tonight, so we'll do that. We need steel. And we need 10 springs, 5 mechanical parts, and 5 schematics. So five schematics, five of those, ten springs, and what was the last bit? Five glue. Do we have five glue? We got four. Might as well go ahead. We don't have any... Oh, murky water. Really? Really? We will in a second, though. Um, let's do this. I should really find out what time of day it is. Do that in a minute. Uh, we can just grab the water from here. And then we can make glue. Which I'll probably make like 10 or something. I'll make a bunch just so we have it. Uh, bones. Here we go. Glue, glue, glue. Like 11? 250? Take that out. Uh, where is my wood? We'll make enough to fill that. Twelve. Beautiful. Perfect. Drop you in there. You can go back in there. You guys can go in there. We just need the one glue and then we're off. Well, almost off. Okay, I feel pretty good about this horde night. I think we're going to be alright. I think we're going to be just fine. Um, there's the crickets. So we're making good time. Let's grab one of you before we go. So I don't have to burn my, uh, the food that I have on me. Although I probably want to grab, let's grab one of you. Let's grab, um, okay, you don't have what I want. I don't have what I want. What I need from you though. What are you looking for? Uh, a couple things, not jobs. Um, inventory. I want to buy a plaster cast off you. And I want to buy a splint off you. You're welcome. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now you... Uh, what did I want to talk to you for? 
Did I want to talk to you? I didn't want to talk to you. Alright. So, um... Oh, repair kits. Right. Mod, we want to go down and grab... Where are you? Magazine extender. Starts with an M. Right there. Get you crafting. Might as well grab a couple repair kits just in case. Hugh, I'd advise you to either not be here or not be here. Um, what am I grabbing again? Repair kits. Two is probably more than enough. Alright, uh, let's get out of here. Grab the magazine extender. We might use the pistol tonight, I doubt it. I'm going to try and stick with the rifle, the shotgun, and the molotovs. Got a few seconds, so let's get our loadout here straightened away. I'm not going to need the axe, this, or this on me. In my inventory, I won't need that on me. I won't need the wrench on me. Let's bring down the shotgun and the rifle. Let's bring down the molotovs and the pipe bombs. Might need that for carving up birds, you never know. Uh, I'm not going to need that up there. Going to eat that before we start. I think we're pretty good here. Let's get the high-powered ammo in here. Burn through that fast. Almost done. Shotgun should be loaded, right? Yep, shotgun's loaded. Pistol will unload in a second. Alright. That thunder and lightning's not worrying me at all. I didn't bring any uh, cobblestone. It's a just-in-case thing. Like, I don't think we'll need it, but if for whatever reason we need to, like, have blocks or something. For some reason, at least we've got cobblestone to make some blocks. Alright. Um, let's do, uh, before we go. Let's make 30 frame shapes as well. Because you never know. Uh, we'll modify the pistol when we get over there. It's so fucking dark. Like, do we have time? We should have time. It's only a few meters away. Right? No problems? No problems at all? Let's get up there the safe way. Safe way is doing it like this. Okay. Let's not die. Alright, so the horde's just about to come. We got about like another couple of minutes here before the sun drops, but we're level 8 right now. Experience bar is pretty low. We should be able to get two levels tonight without too much problem, I don't think. 200 enemy kills, game stage 16. So, I mean, I'm not expecting that much. Uh, the only issue with Darkness Falls is I think there's only been one time that I've actually been able to defeat an entire Darkness Falls horde. Because the horde's going to be coming all night long. Horde's set to 8 zombies um, early game like this. Once we get up a little higher level, I'll start cranking it up to go 12, then 16, then 20, 24, and then 32. And then the last horde like we did last time, which was the CPU melter, will do 60, full 64 zombie horde. Which I'm full expecting to murder our base completely. Um, just because trying to manage like that many zombies at that, you know, at that level... It's just going to be insane unless, you know, we have, like, ridiculous amounts of turrets and dart traps and and stuff. Which I'm thinking, based on some of the changes that Kane's made to the demons and stuff, we may have to do. Uh, we know that the um, shotgun and SMG turrets do not um, set off demolishers anymore. So that's going to be really good for us. Because we can set up a, uh, a turret gauntlet. Like, the last time we had our base set up, we had the walkway where we could, you know, see down, kind of shoot them before they got on the walkway. They would make their way around to our door. We would blow them in the head with a shotgun, uh, and they would get electrocuted at the door and everything. So I'm thinking we may want to do that, but instead of that walking gauntlet that they did last time where they had to p just pass by the uh, junk sledge, I think the final we had two junk sledges going, but... Um, We'll have those there, but I think before they get to the junk sledge, 
It's just going to be like SMG turrets, probably, most likely. Keeping up with the ammo is going to be difficult, but if we use the advanced turrets, it takes the steel jacketed ammo. So it'll just be a fact like getting clay and iron, which we know in Darkness Falls is not very hard. And here they come. So that's what we'll probably do for the end. For the first few hordes, though, it's most likely going to be something like this. Because this just makes it so much easier for us to just, like... Kill the zombies off. Let's get them in a, pa in a pack down here. I'm gonna burn the pipe bombs first. Here, hold that, guys. Oh, don't run away from it! There! They're, they're running from it again! Look at this guy. Get over here. Oh, he's pissed. Oh, she took the shot for him. There we go. Let's burn this ammo. It's actually not bad damage. Look at the survivor coming over. I'm probably going to end up killing you, buddy. I have to apologize for that. Uh, let's start with one of these guys. Get that going. Get off my tree. I missed. How did I miss that? Damn it. I get trigger crazy. Right over his shoulder. Damn it. There we go. Come on, Kenny. Get inside here. How many rounds we got left? Six. You son of a bitch! No. No, you won't. I'm probably going to end up dropping a Molotov on you. Just warning you right now. Oh. Just knocking him down. Yeah, pipe bombs aren't as good in uh, Darkness Falls, I don't think. I think you really need to have a base set up to use them. If you're gonna do it. Ah, yeah, they're inside now. Alright, let's see what they're doing over here. Victory is mine. Who are you? Oh, I see. I'm really sorry, buddy, but that's gotta happen. Let's bring our other two Molotovs down. I'm fully expecting birds tonight. It's about the time them to start showing up too. Usually the first wave of zombies is like regular guys. Like regular idiots. And then the uh, waves that follow, like usually it's like animals and stuff right after. Like the bird. Out. Gotta be careful. If anything is going to get us tonight, it will probably be birds. Okay, it was probably a zombie spawn right afterwards. The great thing about this place is that there's that big hole in the center. They fall down in. And then they're just beating away in the bottom of the walls. Come on up here, guys. Oh, you're a dog. Oh, hey, buddy. I'm gonna use up my last little bit of ammo on you. We got two rounds left. Where are you? I heard you... Over here. I don't see that vulture anywhere. There you are. What do you think? Got him. Yeah, we got a spider monkey spawn, so... And that was a miss. Get this ammo loaded. Chittering monkey.
How does that uh, poem go again? What is it? The, or sorry, it's a haiku. Chittering monkey um, in the spring he climbs trees and thinks himself tall or something like that. Can't remember the whole thing. If you've ever watched uh, Avatar the Animated Series, there's a whole uh, scene where Sokka actually falls into this uh, um, building. I think he was trying to avoid somebody. He fell into this building and it was uh, a uh, haiku, like a haiku school. And the teacher basically take he accidentally does a haiku when he felt when he falls in, and then the students just kind of chuckle, and then he's like, she challenges them to to a, basically a haiku duel. It was it was really brilliant. And he just kind of like does a really great job until the end, and then uh, he miss uh, he miss syllables a haiku, and they, they just kick him out. Anyway, it's, it was just really funny. Cop. I'm hearing another cop too. It's not just one, it's two. Or oh, it's a Hawaiian guy. Die with his butt in the air. It's starting to sound nasty down there. That's probably a Hawaiian guy. Military zombie. Oh, that's the guy I'm hearing right there. Is it? Shit, missed him. Yeah, that's the guy I'm hearing. We've got to get our shotguns up a level here, too. Yeah, because he, he can puke too, right? Just I don't think his puke goes very far. Hopefully that gets some people inside the building here as well. I doubt it, but... Okay, we got that guy. Another one died. Another one died. Alright, we're level 9. Still doing well. I don't know what time of day it is, but... I think we finished about half the horde, I think. Did I miss him? I think I did. Oh, Jesus, buddy. Come on, we gotta get a headshot here. There we go. Get up. There we go. That's what we need. I don't hear any birds. I hope there isn't too many guys in the, uh... I hope there isn't too many guys down in the, uh, basement. These guys are not gonna die by flames alone. That should kill them, though. Come on, you mutated fucker. Missed him. Another Hawaiian guy died. I don't know how much damage I did there. I don't want to hit the uh, cop with uh, Molotov because I don't want him to like go into blow up mode and go inside and then blow up. Okay, you're done. Should be able to drop another Molotov here. Get me at least two or three. Come on, spider, get over here. There you go, jump right in the flames. That should kill that guy. Yeah, I think there's a bunch of them trapped down below. They probably broke the ladder out down there. Come on, you guys. That should get me at least two or three there, I think. I know we've got at least two. Halfway to the next level. 
Yeah, click of death. We drop another one? Yeah, we bought them for Horde. Beautiful. Hopefully that spider comes over here. Get over here. You! In the flames! I don't think it'll work. Nah. You avoid them for long. Too long. Come on, buddy. Dodge this. That guy? Yeah, there. Get right in the flames, buddy. Right in the flames. So we're at the end kind of stages of the horde now. It'll be mostly regular idiots, I think. Here comes some more. Yeah, I mean, like, I don't know why people spend too much time building horde bases early game for dark for seven days to die. Even darkness falls because there's no real re reason to. You know? It's really all you need is like a building like this that's like made out of concrete. Even brick would probably do. As long as it's big enough, right? You just don't get a lot of XP for using your weapons. Unless you're firing them continuously all night. But you don't want to like... On a series like this, you don't want to waste your too much ammo because you're going to have a horde maybe in two days. So you're not going to get a lot of time to like replenish it. That was a shoulder shot. Get off the tree. I just shot the tree. Shot the tree. Could probably hold off using these guys now. Well, not, my aim is going to continue like that. But this guy's damaged. Wow. At a certain point, though, once we rank up shotguns a, a bit with the farmer skill and with the uh, regular shotgun skills, and get a pump shotgun, we can do a lot of damage. We just got to use this skill here. So that we can uh, rank it up. Yeah, I think a lot of them are down in the. Uh, can't not use that right now. There we go. That should get me close to uh, another level. Okay, more of them coming in. Get off of that thing. Perfect time. Come on, Kenny, come over here too. That's another four. There's the level. Level 10. We don't really need to shoot anything else tonight if we don't want to. That was what we were looking for, but... We'll burn what we can. I mean, if we can get Molotovs as quest rewards, hopefully, then um, that'll definitely make it worth it to uh, keep burning Molotovs early. Get over here. Die. Just die. Not doing very well with the shotgun, I'll tell you. Might not be a good idea to freaking spec into shotguns. Yes, burn, burn, burn. Not much of a horde base, but these guys aren't bringing this building down anytime soon. I, I know somebody's hitting. I think they're just like inside. Ooh, that was a headshot. I can't not. I can't not do that. I mean, we can, We have the ability to make pipe bombs too, so we could just rely on pipe bombs for the next horde if we have to. Oops. 
I thought I needed to shoot him, but... Is that it, Saruman? Is that all you've got? I think so. I think we defeated the Horde pretty much, except for the guy inside. I ain't jumping down there to find out, though. Because they broke the ladder out, so I can't get back up. But, uh... I think that's probably it. I brought the vitamin just in case I needed to take it to avoid getting, a uh, disease, but... I want to jump down? Actually, let's make a ladder. Shape, uh, where's my ladders? Here. Oh, hey. He decided to come back up. Right between the shoulder blades. That's it, I think. Uh, let's do this. Can I get... Can I get one under there? I can. No, I can't. Okay, I can climb up there if I have to. Keep the pistol out. Okay, shovel crowbar. So tomorrow I think what we'll do... Okay, not bad is we'll make a writing desk. Problem is, is I need, in order to make a, uh, oops, more orange dye, in order to make a, um, a, uh, book for the, uh, the next, like, the next skill class, I gotta have four black dyes, because it requires two dyes per ink, and I need two ink per, um, per book. I got two black dyes on me now, and then, I I mean, we got to make dye, which is not too much of a problem. The recipes are pretty simple. I think I've got enough to make one dye. Well, no. Because we'll probably have to do it in the campfire, and then it's going to take forever. Like, there's the morning. All right, I'm going to go ahead and hack up all of this goop, because we want to take this back with us. Uh, and then what I'll do is... Like, this base is probably done for Horde, I think. Like, I don't think we're going to want to run the Horde here again. Eh, maybe we do. Like, I don't know. We'll think about it. It depends on what day it's going to be. If we get it on, if we get a Horde on day six, then maybe we go ahead and make this our Horde base. If we get a Horde um, later, then we can probably go ahead and make our Horde base, like, someplace else because our game stage will be a little higher by that point you know uh, let's bring the axe down anyway I'm going to make it back to the trader I'm going to sell this stuff and then ah oh, shit really it's tricked out I don't think you can fix that either so tree is basically immune to damage now actually that might be a good horde base <laughs> put a bunch of those trees around that can't get destroyed and then let the zombies hit them Anyway, I'm going to end this episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And you can drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.